Uh, a judge approved a settlement between the IRS and hundreds of Tea Party groups in which the IRS reportedly agreed to pay out three and a half million bucks. Guess what? The lawyers got half of that. Joining us is Grover Norquist with Americans for Tax Reform. <clears throat> Grover, is yeah. this a satisfying conclusion for you to this whole mess? No, obviously not. What happened, if you <clears throat> remember, shortly after the Obama administration came into power, they did the massive uh, trillion-dollar stimulus spending, and then they said, and we're going to take over health care, Obamacare, and we're going to have massive taxes on energy. And there were demonstrations in the streets in April. Uh, maybe a million people demonstrated uh, in about a 1,000 rallies uh, across the country. In the next three years... One of the hundreds of groups, Tea Party groups, that we'd like to incorporate so we can get a bank account and, and, and have an organization here, one got the IRS approval for, to incorporate a nonprofit status. This was an effort, not by the Russians to spend $100,000 on Facebook, right. but by the United States government, the IRS, to smother a political movement by making it impossible for them to get bank accounts or get people to contribute to them because... They weren't given, we're not allowed right. to have a nonprofit status. It was huge and it affected all elections since then. Well, there's a lot of galling factors about this. A, that the settlement means that the IRS admits no wrongdoing. Of the settlement money, literally 50% of that goes to lawyers. Each individual group that were targeted gets about $17,000 each. And then we get this from the IRS saying, well, we've made changes, so, quote, political targeting can't happen again. Do you buy that? No, because I was on a commission to look at the IRS back in the 90s. Uh, and back then under Clinton, uh, I was talking to my left-wing friends. I said, are you guys getting audited because Heritage and the NRA and all these conservative citizens against government waste, all these conservative groups were being audited by the Obama uh, IRS, and none of the liberal groups were. And when I asked the head of the IRS, because I was on the commission, I asked the question, he said, oh, no, we've got this wonderful system to make sure it's terribly nonpartisan. Great. We'd love to see it. Explain it to us. Oh, no, it's secret. You'll have to trust us. Uh, yeah, trust us. When everyone says that, you, the first thing you do is not trust them. Yeah. Also galling, by the way, Lois uh, Lerner, we know, who was reviewed by the Department of Justice under the Obama administration, she was cleared of any wrongdoing, even though she pled the fifth and wouldn't talk in public testimony. She was called a hero in that investigation for trying to, stro to stop this practice. Give me a break. No, nonsense. I mean, this was a deliberate effort by the administration. She was in and out of the White House. What does the head of the IRS need to be in and out of the White House, you know, dozens <laughs> of times? The, the communication, the collusion between the White House and the IRS was constant uh, and, and showed up in behavior. Uh, there was no... And also the IRS, remember, would take the list that you can contribute to the <clears throat> NAACP... Right privately, because back in the 50s, a court ruled, Ugh. you know, pe bad people were trying to get the, uh, yes. the National Association of the Advancement of Color People, NAACP's list, to go after the donors. So they said, those are secret. Right. The, and so they're legally secret so that you don't harass donors. The, uh, the IRS we'll people were handing there, Grover. those lists out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it's unsatisfying yeah. end to your interview here and, and to the uh, whole IRS debacle on targeting the Tea Party. Uh, it is very unsatisfying. Uh, I guess you can put it to rest for now, but uh, what a horrible black mark in history that, what that whole episode was. Grover Norquist, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Uh,